to do um, scheduled feedings. You want to take them outside to go potty on leash and just be sure that there is no off leash time until he or she goes to the bathroom. Make sure that you're giving the sufficient amount of food that they need for their schedule. Um, feed once or twice a day. If they don't eat their food when you put it down, bring it up 10 to 15 minutes after they eat it or don't eat it. Um, be sure to put it down for their next meal and see if they will eat. Um, if they don't, then try again the next feeding time. But don't give them an opportunity to eat it later on in the day when it's not their scheduled time. Scheduled feedings are good for potty training because you'll know when they need to eliminate. Dogs and puppies eliminate 10 to 15 minutes after they eat or drink. So that's a good way to know after they eat, they're ready to go outside to go potty. When it's time to take them out to go potty, be sure to take them out on leash. Um, it can be tied to you or you can just have it when you go outside. Um, and take them outside and usually dogs and puppies go potty in one area and they defecate in another. So they urinate in some area and they go far away usually um, to defecate in another. So um, kind of pick up on that and take them to those same areas each time. Um, move around the yard instead of just standing there and telling them to go potty. Move around the yard. Movement equals movement. The more they move around, the more that they're going to need the urge to go to the bathroom. If your dog did not go potty outside when you took them outside, they need to come back in and either be tied to you so you can watch them for signs to go potty outside or in their safe zone, their kennel. Um, you're going to want to bring them in for 5 to 10 minutes and try again after the 5 or 10 minutes. If they don't go again, you're going to do the same thing. Have them tied to you or in their kennel. 